Hello ladies and gentlemen, Kevin Inkster from Overdeck here. Um, as you may know, we recently released the uh, uh, turbo plane to worldwide acclaim. Um, it's just been a fantastic blade for us. We've got uh, so many reports from people saying they think it's the smoothest, safest, um, easiest blade um, that they've ever used for this kind of freehand shaping. Um, an immediate result from releasing this product is that we uh, had a lot of requests from people asking for a smaller one, a mini one, to fit onto the mini grinder. And the result of that is this wonderful little tool, which we call the mini turbo plane. Now the mini turbo plane differs from the larger one in that it has small replaceable carbide teeth. In fact, these are the same carbide teeth that we have on the industrial blades. Um, a lot of people really like that uh, ability to be able to replace the carbide teeth and of course it does come with a, with a, a little Ian key which uh, fits in here and you can release it and rotate it to a new sharp edge so you get an extra life out of this little blade. It has the same benefit as the larger blade in that there's no cutting edge on the perimeter and so we can use it to run against guides and templates and those sorts of things um, but it also can do a lot, lot more. Now one of the things we discovered with this blade is that we can fit it onto an extension arm that you see here and this extension arm can then be fitted to a standard angle grinder and so you can use it without the actual mini grinder uh, to do some really amazing cuts. Now I'll just quickly show you uh, the parts that will come in the kit with the mini turbo plane. So if you look down here, you'll see it's going to be supplied with uh, uh, the mini turbo the key, etc., uh, for releasing and changing the carbide. It's going to come with the extension arm, which will fit onto any angle grinder that's on the market. And we're also going to include in it um, four sanding pads. Now, these sanding pads can actually be fitted to the uh, uh, to the extension arm and follow any shape that you've machined using the mini turbo plane. And I'll demonstrate all that for you shortly.